It's hair in a bun, get stuff done kind of day. We're gonna have a real motivational Monday. It's gonna be fabulous. Power juice, cleaning caddy. Let's get this house ready for Christmas. You know what that is? I'm feeling like I'm just about ready for the trees to be allowed to go up. Oh, <laughs> Bye, gorgeous husband. Oh, you've got your yeah, banana and your orange. Sounds Oh, have you got your coffee, your hot coffee and your flask? No, because I'm coming back. Oh, are you? Yeah. Okay. I've only got half day away. Go on then, get gone. Love you. I'm lucky. I'm going to go back. Well, I'm going to go back. You know, when I get home, I'll be working in the office. Love you, Mum. Have a nice day. My mum is off to school. Bye, dogs. Oh, you're still off to school. I've got my banky. Where's that? What an ordeal to get out of the house. Love you, Mum. Love you, babe. Mwah. Mwah. Love you, babes. Love you. Love you. Go on, get gone now. Shut the door Love you, Mum. Love you. Love you, Mum. Love you. Do you know what day it is today, guys? We're going to excuse the sitch. It's hair in a bun, get stuff done kind of day. We're going to have a real motivational Monday. It's going to be fabulous. We're on the first coffee of the day, oat milk coffee. And, oh, the kids are pecking at me every single day at the minute. Like, are we getting the trees up? Mum, can the trees go up today? And I've been putting them off and putting them off because to be honest, I'm really not in the mood yet. I've not got the exciting Christmassy feels that you get to put the tree up. It just seems like, a huge daunting task that I really don't want to do. There's so much to get down from the attic. We've got four trees that go up. So I've got two that are like my trees that I've just like built and collected decks for over the years, which I absolutely love, by the way. I'm not in any rush to change them. So one is like a real romantic, girly, glam tree. And the other one is super fun, multicoloured, candy, just everything. And I love those two trees. And then the kids have got a tree each in their bedroom. And then there's loads of other stuff up there as well, which... So I thought today needs to be a super productive day. I want to do organisation. I've got some cupboards I want to sort. I want to do the big, deep clean. I want to get myself ready and excited to deck the house and for me that means getting even on top of like all my washing my ironing I just want that like calm clean feeling we're gonna get it all done I've got a real busy day I'm gonna start off with a jog because some of you all know I keep sharing it on previous vlogs I know not everybody's like in the health mode at the moment it's Christmas approaching but I am seriously on this health journey and I am taking steps to change my life and it's all going amazing I can't wait to share so much more of that with you in January especially when people might want to watch it but I need to go and get my jog out of the way this morning anyway guys because I jog now you know I jog most mornings <laughs> super proud of myself it's only a little one but you know what it makes me feel so much better and it keeps my back pain at bay anyway jog that's en route to food shop because i've got to go get a food shop I've got friends coming for dinner tomorrow evening i've got a baker cake today as well you know just throw that in the mix but that's no biggie i made with nancy a few vlogs ago the red velvet cream cheese frosting cake which actually turned out amazing. It didn't look amazing because I made a little blunder with the cream cheese frosting and it was a little bit sloppy, but oh my gosh, I had a slither of that cake the following day 
it was scrumptious i'm gonna leave the recipe down below in the description box because it's a super easy one to make and it was such a soft squidgy like velvety gorgeous cake like so i'm gonna throw that in today as well my friends can have that when they come over tomorrow and yeah i've just got a real busy day we're gonna do lots so if you're feeling the same and you're feeling a little bit unmotivated and stressed out by the task of getting the decks out because let's be honest it feels like two seconds ago i was doing this so yeah anyway guys happy monday probably not watching this on a monday it's probably a wednesday or a sunday vlog but um shall we get going let's get the exercise out the way always almost talk myself out of it every morning by thinking i can be so much more productive with my time get more done but you've got to get it out of the way i know once i've done it my entire day is always so much more productive so off we go guys get the steps in let's go Exercise done, food shop done, although it took me way longer than I imagined because I ended up going to three different shops. There's always a shop that doesn't have what you want and sometimes I just think, bugger it, I'll get it next time. But I really wanted everything today. So I had to go to a different shop for my celery, a different shop for my powdered sugar and a different shop for my red food colouring. But first things first, I want to just get this cake out of the way. It'll only take me like half an hour to get it all mixed together and get in the oven. And then once that's done, it can just rest and be covered and I can deal with that tomorrow. Um, I always feel like such a nutter as well going to get my celery for the week. Look at this. <laughs> I feel like such a health girl, like walking around with this. But... I'm going to juice this as well because it doesn't fit in the fridge and what I've been doing is getting all my juice because this literally turns like it's amazing when you juice stuff how little it turns to so get it all juiced put it in my let me show you I've got a really good container that I keep my juice in and it holds quite a lot so it'll go in this this is one that I actually got with my juicer but it's really good like thermal flask kind of thing inside there so I just make my juice in bulk obviously pop it in there that'll go in the fridge and then it usually goes in some extra as well and then that kind of lasts me four or five days ish I've got celery juice for four or five days so I'll just have like a glass every morning life changing honestly so I'm going to get my celery juiced so that it's not taking over the kitchen Get my cake made and then let's get on with the house blitz. Motivation. <laughs> Also got my 
cleaning caddy at the ready. Let's get this house ready for Christmas. <laughs> desk look at that you know what that is whenever he's got a small hole in his sock he puts his finger through it and he rips his socks off boys I had the most crazy busy day yesterday. Sorry if I didn't get much cleaning footage. I haven't even checked it over yet, but I can tell you that I did way more than what you saw. I, like, I was just on this crazy mad mission before the kids got home from school. But everything's just about done. I mean, you could go on and on, couldn't you? But I'm feeling like I'm just about ready for the trees to be allowed to go up. I've got a couple more windows to do in the kids' rooms and I'm just being fussy, but everywhere's clean and sorted. <sighs> the big clean is done. So, today is not the tree going up day. I think that's going to be the next vlog that you will see because I will probably do that in the next couple of days anyway because it won't be long before the kids ask again. And I've got some friends coming over for dinner. The kids are going to be arriving home from school. I've got a few bits left to do in the kitchen. I have got to ice the cake that I made yesterday. And I've also got to make some bechamel sauce, put a lasagna together, make a salad. Quite a lot, actually, now I've just listed it. So um, do you want to hang around? Do you want to stay for tea? Have a bit of tea with us? I've got lots to do. It might be fun to watch. So I will skip to that footage now. And if I don't get a chance to say bye, I will see you all in my next video, which will be Decorate With Us for Christmas 2022. Okay, here's my cake that I made yesterday. So I just let it cool. And then last night, wrapped it in some cling film and it's just been resting there. It looks like quite a good one. It feels quite squidgy but firm, which is good. And last night I also made some cream cheese frosting and that's been in the fridge. So that just needs another little whip up and then we're gonna put the cream cheese frosting on here. And then, had another busy day guys. So this morning I made the bolognese for the lasagna and then I transferred it into the slow cooker and it's literally just been on a real slow cook all day. Oh, 
it looks like a good one. So now I just need to prepare the lasagna, make the bechamel sauce, get a salad made. Let's go. Here's my cream cheese frosting. Looks like it's gone pretty firm, which is good because it's really difficult to get the cream cheese frosting really smooth because it's prone to like getting little lumps in and also firm because it goes quite runny but that looks quite good so I'm going to give it a last mix and then we can get this cake iced and that's dessert finished and then it's time to get on with the rest. going up on or should I say trees oh yes oh of course. yes we are now aren't we it feels like 10 minutes since we put them away I know I feel the same oh, this looks like a good cake I can't wait to try that cake yeah it's mainly for you and the kids the men and the kids I'm just priming my gut with antacid Ready oh, for the getting feast. ready for the feast. Yeah. Good. Oh, so yes. There's going to be lots of food. baguettes now what is it by you when you ask for a tradition it's just the original recipe it's not been messed with isn't it no additives no additives that's it i knew it was the good one um garlic bread we're gonna do so here we've got slop dosh now it's this salt good salt it's butter obviously and minced garlic and i'm just gonna spread this on here, ready to go under the grill in a little while. Have it. Look who we've got, very special guest. Where is she? She's got a hound's tooth on. Look at your little booties. She is autumn and winter ready. Official. She's got the Uggs, very on trend of over. These yeah, are very are hard to get. And the camel hound's tooth. Love it. Styled by? What? <laughs> 
Okay, raclette. Then raclette. We're topping the lasagna with raclette just to make it a little bit more naughty. French lasagna. Yeah, very naughty. But we've held some bolognese back and we've got some gluten free spaghetti, haven't we, Holly? How boring. Because Holly's, um, what do you call Annoyingly it? Annoyingly celiac. Celiac, that's it. But it's great, don't be offended if you want. <laughs> <laughs> It's always keeps away, you it's always away. It, it keeps, keeps you trim. You trim. It actually does. Right, right you do. that's ready to go in when we're ready. Check it out. Check it out. Will it come out good? Will the sheets be soft enough? All will be revealed soon. I'm done, Hall. I'm free. Friggin' sit down. I'm free now to drink my wine. We've done the salad you dressing. I know. Oh, You, else. Holly, what else we do? Holly's Shopping. fantastic. We'll just eat. <laughs> You're amazing. You've got all the restaurant experience as well. With my, um, what do you do for a very quick salad dressing? Olive oil. And olive oil and balsamic. Yeah, and a bit of mustard, do you? Right, well, we've got olive oil, lemon, lemon honey. honey, some salt with herbs in. Oh, yeah, where's salt? Do you need to get that in? With herbs in. It's been it, it's gone in. That's a game changer, that one. Fleur de sol. Uh, yeah, we're done. Right, I can drink now. I can have a drink. Pink and green, of course. How did you know? You look absolutely gorgeous. I love what nah, you changed into when that. you got home from work. Do you want to have any I love it. No, I don't like that. Oh. I've got crocs. Oh, crocs. Have you got crocs? Yeah, can't be a good pair of crocs. I agree. Although well, I've not got any. Though. But yeah, Nancy's got some. Hello. Yeah. Hello. 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 very drippy but it's nice I'll leave the recipe down below it's a nice squidgy red velvet cake it's just that frosting I can't get right but hey we're going with it 